Today you can follow me to a beautiful mountain overnight uh, here in the Bavarian woods. We would take a look in a beautiful small cave and enjoy the beautiful mountain landscape here. So if you want, come with me. Do you see this little bit of water? And can you think how many water must come here down from the mountain that such a massive barrage is needed? What is now a very small river can be to a torrential if there is rain in the mountains and if there are um, on the feet of the mountains, um, if there live people or there is a street, the people make such barrage to protect the people here downside. Because um, when it rains really strong, there come a lot of stones and trees with the water down to the foot of the mountain. This is a really magical and mystical place. Do you see the hole here? It is a cave, a beautiful small cave. And um, this cave works like a siphon. When it rains strong, the water comes out here and there's a small sea in, on top of the cave. And yeah, I can't see this spectacle when the water comes out, but this is now better for us because now we can take a look inside the cave.
I am now inside of the cave and it's a little bit dangerous because um, it goes here very deep down and at the end of the cave there is only water and here are many small stones and I can't go really safe on these stones. The wall is very slicey and I, I have not many hold here so I, I must look that I don't fall and yeah, fall down. There are people that um, are swimming here um, in the cave through the water um, to look how long the cave is but they don't come really wide inside of the mountain because they can't see the water is here on the start clear but then um, there is um, um, really much um, stones, small stones in the water so they can't see really wide. So nobody knows how deep the hole is and what is inside of the cave. The stones are from the middle of the mountain and they came the first time to the daylight now. At the next time when the water is coming out they are put down here through the holes and into the small sea. This was not the first time I was in this cave, but at this time I don't feel safe because um, something is different. There is so... Um, normally there is some no more water in this cave and here... Yeah, I can't find the right words, I don't feel safe today. But on the way out I found these beautiful stones, they are on the daylight for the first time and one of the stones is for my... Um, German subscribers and one for you, my English subscribers. And if you want one of the stones, um, please write it down in the comments and maybe you are the lucky winner.
This is the uh, creek. Is it a creek from the river? You see, it is a very wide area, but the water is just very, um, very small. Um, so beautiful as it looks here, never, never camp in such an area because when it rains upstairs in the mountain, maybe you don't, um, you don't see it and the water comes so fast, really. Sometimes it can be just seconds or minutes to react and you hear the water only a few sec seconds before it is there and this is very dangerous. So please be careful and don't stay and don't um, camp in such an area. What is this? Do you ever have seen something like this? It looks in the middle like blood and outside like water. Just like art. I want to go a little bit higher because upside there is the sun but if I don't find a good camp place up there I want to go down because here it looks very beautiful. I am on an animal path now. Normally I don't use them because I want that the wild animals have their peace. But today I use the path because the animals know the easiest way 
upside. The signs. What a present. Fishing. Thank you. Looks like blood. I'm not sure if I should go this way uh, anymore. It's not so easy, but it doesn't matter. I will go up and when it is just for a little bit, go. Looks like there are going many animals. Do you see this? On the other side there, are, uh, there is a house and I don't think that it's good to stay here overnight because when the people see the fire, maybe they can mean that this is a signal fire and I need help. And this is not good. Okay. Then we just go up there for the view and after we enjoy the view I will go upside for the camping place. Isn't it beautiful? Okay, down again. When we go down we always go a little bit faster but this is, isn't right. Yeah. Um, I just um, fall down here in the slippery animal path. Just go a little bit slowly. I am a little bit down now and yeah, it's really hot you see. Um, I just make a little a break and then build my camp.
Sleeping in the BV bag is a really fast um, thing to have a dry sleeping place. But um, there is one thing that I don't like because when it rains and you open the BV bag, the rain comes directly inside to your sleeping equipment. And because of this, I always um, make a small um, top over the BV bag so I can go dry inside and outside the BV bag when it is raining. Okay, the last thing that I must make before I can relax is searching firewood. And then we cook and everything is done. <laughs> 